With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, we are given with a question and the question says that at room temperature, copper has free electron density of 8.4 into 10 to the power 28 per meter cube. Right? This is the density. The copper conductor has a cross section of 10 to the power minus 6 meter square and carries a current of 5.4 ampere. So what is the electron drift velocity in copper? Right? So the current density and drift velocities are e related to each other. Right? That is J. That is electron density. That would be equal to N into E into VD. Right? So from here, what we can say is that electron current density is what? I by A. So that would be equal to N E V D. Right? So from here, the current would be equal to N A E V D. Right? So from here, V D would be equal to I by N A E. Right? So from here, what we could say is that when we substitute the values, since the current that we have is 5.4 amperes, right? The number of free electrons that are 8.4 into 10 to the power 28, 8.4 into 10 to the power 28, right? Into the area is given as 10 to the power minus 6 into electrons so that is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 so that would be equal to when we calculate this this turns out to be equal to 4 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter per second right so that is our drift velocity that is 4 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter per second right so what we can write this to be equal to 4 into 10 to the power minus 2 centimeter per second so that would be equal to 0 0.04 centimeter per second, right? 0 0.04 centimeter per second, or we can write this to be 0 0.4 millimeter per second, right? So that is option D. That is our answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.